This is the tutorial video for the geometric shape project for grade eight. This is the more difficult project, sphere, square, triangle, circle. The first part in this is our sphere. We can see our sphere has a six inch diameter. Also, we can see that we have a three by three square hole that is centered on this. So we're gonna go over to on shape. We're going to create a sketch and we're going to place that sketch down on our front plane. I'm going to orientate myself and I'm going to draw a six inch vertical line. I'm going to hit the escape button to exit that tool. I'm going to go to my three point arc tool, clicking on the ends of the line. I'm going to make a three inch radius. Clicking on my revolve tool, again, I'm going to see that the face of that sketch is highlighted. And what I want to do is I want to revolve around the center axis. Green check mark to finish. And then I'm going to gain perspective on this. Now see that I'm seeing that I'm dealing with a sphere. I cannot put a plane or, or drawing on that circular surface. I have to put a plane. So if we come up here, I'm going to click on my plane button. And I'm going to choose that front plane. And I'm going to offset that my radius, which is three inches. So what I've done now is I've created the new plane, plane one, that's three inches off of my front plane. This allows me to create a sketch, placing it on the plane one I just created. And we can see that we now have that drawing that is in line with that plane one. I'm going to grab my Try my rectangle tool. I'm going to go to the center of my sphere of that center rectangle tool, and I'm going to create a three inch by three inch uh, square. Now, it's important that you use the center rectangle tool and the uh, center point of the sphere uh, to lay down this sketch because you will not be able to dimension it to the outside of the sphere. Next, I'm going to gain perspective, and I'm going to come over to my extrude tool. We can see that we're um, extruding right now to create a new face, but what I actually want to do is I want to go to remove. And because the diameter is six inches, I want to remove six inches of material in the opposite direction. I hit my green check mark, and I've now created my sphere with my six inch square hole. So I'm going to come to my parts here. I'm going to right click on it, rename it, and name it sphere with square hole. 